Hey there, we're going to go over the basics of how to clean your cannon. Uh, this is a golf ball cannon and it uses black powder and the black powder gets pretty messy and uh, so it's really important to keep it clean and oil it after each use. Uh, the steps are pretty simple. Uh, I use this Hops number no. 9 cleaner, works really well. And <clears throat> what we want to make sure we do is uh, cover the fuse hole. If you don't cover the fuse hole, using the method of uh, our drill, it can throw the cleaner or the oil out of the fuse hole. We've learned that the hard way. So um, what we have here is just a piece of solid round stock and a brass brush. The brass brush is nice because it's softer than the steel and it doesn't uh, wear the inside of the bore. And the bore is uh, it's important to try not to do that because it's matched for the size of the golf ball. So first thing we do is uh, put the cleaner in there. We've already uh, done that. And uh, so we just put that in there and drape the rag over the bristles and the bristles grab hold of the rags. You really don't have to do much. It stays pretty well. Now our powder chamber inside is a little smaller diameter, so I have to give it a little bit of a push. You can see it go in. And I might reverse it. And that's really about it. Um, after you've done that uh, a few times, uh, you know, change your rag. I've already cleaned it, but uh, I would recommend you change the rag two or three times depending on how dirty it is. And then once you've done that, put on a new patch. And we'll tear a little piece off of our uh, cover rag here. And put a little oil in there. I use synthetic oil. It really doesn't make any difference. The idea is to uh, just coat the steel on the inside to keep the water out of the uh, out of the steel to prohibit uh, or inhibit rust. So conventional oil, uh, synthetic oil, motor oil, uh, gun oil, it really doesn't matter. So no need to spend lots of money on special oils for this. All right, so we're going to do the same thing with the oil. We'll just go ahead and get it in there. I've got to put my cover rag in when I go in the powder chamber, not make a mess. And that's it. I usually keep the front tilted up a little bit just in case there's uh, some oil that accumulates so that way it doesn't drip out on the floor. But um, until the next time we roll this baby outside, it'll be good and, and preserved. And um, I think we've got a video up on our channel of us shooting the golf ball cannon when we first made it. And uh, all right, well, thanks for viewing, and we'll catch you guys later.